your Bobby B and I'm back with another video. If you're a new subscriber, thank you so much for tuning in. And if you're a regular, thank you for supporting my content. Ladies and gentlemen, we all know what time is it. It is Mugosi time! Yo, the day my parents chased me out of this house, like I won't blame them, Shem. I literally won't blame them because I am literally the loudest. At the same time, yo. I'm coming collector. <laughs> I am loud as hell. I'm literally the the loudest in this house. I'm literally the only one that's loud. And I come to think of it, whenever I'm not around, this house is normally quiet. Like you're not least a room. Come on, clean, you know. Anyways, guys, thank you so much. <coughs> I'm just sorry about that. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in, and thanks to each one of y'all for supporting my content. Like. <laughs> A few moments later. Like guys, I really am grateful. Like, thank you for all the love that y'all have been showing me. Like <laughs> Yeah, so guys, um please keep on liking, keep on commenting. Yeah, like you know, let's just do this thing, right? But then come to think of it, most of y'all prefer talking to me or approaching me privately. Like I've seen it with most with my friends mostly i've seen it with my friends like they don't like commenting they don't like commenting and i don't really blame them because lena like i I've, I've been like that you know before starting youtube like guys not nah, let me just put it like this i am a shy person right i'm a shy person i'm both shy and talkative at the same time i guess it'll just depend on who i'm around or right because sometimes i do get shy right so i guess libona it's the same thing like every time when they think about commenting or doing whatsoever, like they think twice. I get happy. Like we must bear in mind that this is a public platform. If you write one thing, one mistake, pazama, they all gonna get to you. So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing the second part for the for the confession session that I did. If you don't know what a confession session is, a confession session is whereby I. I don't read out names. I just read out um, texts that my followers sent via Instagram. It's like I've said before, because I'm more active on Instagram. I'm more active on Instagram. Like, I, I get within Tangabona. Like, they don't really want to participate in this. I guess I haven't said And I don't understand why, because <laughs> come on, I won't betray you like that. So yeah, a confession session is whereby I'll be reading out confessions from my followers, confessions from my followers. Um, I'll be reading them. They've sent, they sent them via Instagram and yeah, I won't read out any names. So relax. Right. So the first one says, I slept with my lecturer to get good grades. Oh, hell no. I slept with my lecturer. To get good grades. No one don't know the smart the so called gila Joe's kill him. Hey, wait again. I'm an oxala you passed, you know. You passed. Um, what I can say is that don't always take shortcuts in life. Don't always take shortcuts in life because they gotta big fire at the end of the day, right? Like some people rely on shortcuts and they don't they don't just they don't all work out. Yeah, let me put it like that. They don't all work out at the end. Some shortcuts are they're only going to work out for now, for a certain period, if I may say. And the others, ah, they're going to be they're gonna be your downfall. So be careful, Mugo. Who sent this, babe? Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Be careful, Mugo. Be careful that this doesn't make fire at the end of the day and that you don't catch some type of, some kind of disease or whatsoever. Like, be careful, you know. So be careful that it don't it doesn't land you in trouble. Be careful that um, you just don't get in trouble. Make sure that you and the guy are both content about, you know, your sexual relationship. It like it shouldn't be a one way a one way street. It should be beneficial to the both of you, right? in future, That's my advice to you. And then the second one says. I am still in love with my ex. Guys, there'll always be that one ex. There'll always be that one ex that you can't get over, right? Like, there'll always be that one ex 
and over other dula ali a part of your life if i may say so if you're still in love with your ex and if elore you're not seeing anyone at present then tell them tell them how you feel and tell them that you still have something for them you know tell them khora not to go hard them fair to you know maybe lee and um the feeling might be mutual like you'll never know right so this one says yo i hope this doesn't fall um so anonymous says i've been having sex with my i've been having sex with my father for the past seven years your father your blood hey this one is wrong i've been having sex with my father for the past seven years seven years Kanti, how old are you i know this might sound weird but i really am in love with that member Guys, how how does it get to that point? Like, I'm going to be a moment like because this thing Leona young overwhelmed, my young tired and like, like how does it get to that point? Y'all go moto, oh for they in love, the time and how like I don't even look at my dad that way. Like you, <laughs> nah, I can't. But then, please, someone please tell me how does it get to that point? You know, if it has wrong go, oh oh at the time and how like. This is your father we're talking about here. Like, this is your father, you know, the person that birthed you, the person out who is sitting. So, how does it get to that point? No, guys, nah, something is wrong with this generation, if I may say. Something is wrong with this generation because I was. So, I'm again, <clears throat> now I don't know what to say here. Like, I honestly don't know what to say. All I can say is that I am shocked. Worst, or in love with Lena, you know. So I like I don't know. For the first time, I am speechless. Like for the first time, I don't I don't know what to say. So I just, hey, you know, it it might be an attack sometimes. You know, sometimes it might be an attack. You might think that you're in love with someone, and it it might happen that um the enemy is the one Elore, well test, you know. So. Pray, pray about it, because it's not normal for a child to fall in love with their father. You know, it's it's really not normal. So pray about it. Ask God to lead you. You know, ask God to show you the way. Because this is not normal, if I may say this is not normal. Like, how do you even look at your dad and obey feeling I can't shame. And then the last part of this confession says, now I see what my mother saw in him. Miguel! Whether you are a gone girl like you're a gone girl and yeah you need some serious cleansing because this is not normal this is definitely not normal how the hell do you fall in love with your father like make it make sense like how does it reach that point over fall in love with time and how like you know right so the fourth one says okay my boyfriend had sex with some girl and said it was a mistake. Please, it wasn't a mistake. It definitely wasn't a mistake. There's no such thing as a mistake. Mistake is wrong. He couldn't see. Like, what happened? No, it wasn't a mistake. For It wasn't a mistake. Uh -uh. Tell, him, tell him I said that. Tell him I said it wasn't a mistake. It was definitely a mistake. He did that intentionally. You know, he did that intentionally. There's no such thing as sleeping with someone. I got the bottom. It was a mistake. It was a mistake for what? For who? Never shame. I, like, no. So my boyfriend had sex with some girl and said it was a mistake. I later returned the favor by sleeping with his best friend. Yeah! Okay, so this one says, No, like, truly speaking, I think that some of y'all libua makaka some of these confessions because none of this makes sense. Listen to this, guys. This one says, name, Anonymous says, I had a threesome with my stepdad and his best friend. No. No. 
so tsho go wena o nontso she be step for this whole this whole time o jalla mama ga that's what you've been doing and don't tell me that it was a mistake don't say that it was a mistake it's definitely not a mistake how the hell do you sleep with your stepfather and his best friend at the same time ke mba tragi no like i no 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 let's be serious guys mara you know some girls i let the to the thing with no i let la diet that's all i can say Miguel we end it ne we end the makwa how like you've left your mark and I hope that you can live with this for the rest of your days cuz at the end of the day God is watching you you know God is watching you the very same mother elo o mushapa ka stin and the demdim o lo molwanela so tomorrow how did blood how did survive shapo skala nge man lo ile ban lo when we do ya o shapa mama ka stin aba jwa Okay, so now it's time for the actual video. Like I wanted to get my nails over and done with. That's what's up. Okay, so I'm gonna be having a vanilla ice cream, right? And I'm not a fan of vanilla. I'm just eating it for the sake of eating, right? So where was I? Um. Oh, okay. Hmm. One thing I love about ice cream, ne? Yeah, hi, Melty. Let's go. Like, my name not. It's not bad. It's just that the other the ice cream is colorful. You know, I don't like these plain ones. Like I don't like them. Hmm. So where was I? Um. So this one says. Okay. I spent over 2k on my boyfriend monthly. How do I tell him that I'm tired? How do I tell him that I'm tired? Um, I don't know. Just go for it. Tell him how to after all the relationship should be 50/50, right? You shouldn't be the only one contributing. How we join la jola. Pay that in mind. So I'll let the guy know that you're tired and and that you feel overwhelmed and that how to say ha relationship be a bereka ngili one guys elogo there is only one person elogo o bereka ali one you know like high span you know high span so tell your boyfriend that you're tired and that he should also contribute as well after all le jala le le two how we jolly model. Right, so number seven says, B, please keep me anonymous, obviously. I am dating my mother's manager, okay? We met during a gala dinner at their workplace. Now dude wants to make me his second wife. <sighs> your first mistake was dating your mother's manager. Did you even think, God, you are putting your mother's job at risk? Why am I saying this? I'm saying this because I get a lot of obviously a lot of So obviously, how when I was in mood, I was in mood. Punishment is not going to go to my house. So did you think about that? Oh, no. I was like, I was like, I was like, I So now it's worse. Guy already has a wife. Like you want to be a side chick, cause guy or other wife yeah, when I auto use her as a sex toy, I get you young. Obviously, you still energetic, you still fresh. That's what he wants, right? That's something that maybe eba eba like in their marriage, right? That's why I cheat am guy. So don't think that you're gonna take the first wife's place. Don't think that. Think about your mother. Hoch. Mogi pa isi samwak. Ile neti ve. Okay. So the last one says. Okay, so this one is wrong. Hey, so my situation is not really a confession, but here we go. 
and please keep me anonymous. Obviously, guys, can really keep her anonymous. Come on, I can pimpy, I can pimpy. How? <laughs> okay, so my situation is not really a confession. Yes, yes, yes. Please keep me anonymous, right? So I've been dating my girlfriend for three years now. Okay, and then what happens? I will. It so happened that last year, September, she introduced me to her gay friend. Guy and I have been having sex ever since. Which means when I since only game, guy. I, fo I found out this year that dude infected me with HIV. Oh, like, why did you cheat? No, I know it's wrong to say that. Not to all lie, lost, but all lie. All lie. Why did you cheat on your girlfriend? Your girlfriend of three years, first of all. Like, why? Why didn't you come clean? Oh, excuse. In the first place. Why didn't you why didn't you just tell Miguel that um you're not feeling her? You're not for the you're not for the guy's team or whatsoever. Why? Why? Why do you someone about to look? So chung one over to Lena Umifecti. You know, so Baole didn't find Husky see that you are sick, but Baole, like you don't do that to people. You don't do that to people, guys. You don't do that to people. Elo they push it for so long. Sometimes God will not punish. God will show you. Remember that God works in mysterious ways, right? So God help punish, and remember that God God is a God of vengeance, right? God is a God of vengeance. So. If unahana ugrudli someone about to book local and you're always gonna win at the end of the day, clearly you don't know. You don't know that. So I'm really sorry about your status. I'm sorry that um walwala. But let this be a lesson. Ma bale. I like I still stand on that bale. So more. How do I tell my girl that I'm positive? How do you even tell her? What are you going to say? Like, I don't know. Where are you Where where are you even going to start, right? Like, Nike TV, guys. Like, I'm not a relationship expert. And I don't understand why they go... I don't know. Tell her. You know? And that our goodies. So how do I tell my girl that I'm positive? I don't know. I don't know. Because at the end of the day, if you are still planning on continuing with your relationship with your girlfriend and, you know, keeping things underground with the guy, Miguel owns that like she's still going to find out, right? So come clean already. Tell her that, babe, I'm positive. So the only problem now go with the guy. Right? That's what you are going to have to deal with. So how do I tell my girl that I'm positive? Okay. I've been avoiding having sexual intimacy with her after finding out my status. Okay, that's a good thing. At least um it's even though Michi is. Well, seeing that um you haven't slept with her ever since finding out your status, we don't know before I guess because over you've been avoiding having sexual intimacy with her after finding out your status, right? So we don't know about before. So just let her know for the entire clear narrow test. Yo, but be prepared to die. Be prepared to die. She's gonna kill you, Shane. Cause if you look my about to run out of positive. So I wanna get logging at police in sack. Anyways, guys, that's the end of today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment for more videos, right? I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.